Hey everybody, welcome back. We're at the Twisted uh, Nightmare here at uh, the Quality in Middleburg Heights. Nice to have things so close, so close to home, you know. Not, not, not a lot of travel time, yeah. which is not exactly the same for this gentleman here. I think we all probably recognize this guy from. Uh, well, it's uh, yeah. Obviously, you hear it all the time. I'm sure. No, what, go ahead. What, what, Say what, it again. What, 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 do you, what, do you, what do you get more? The Dr. Pepper guy, or the American Werewolf in London guy, or or what else? Or, or, uh, yeah, or, or is there anything else? There's other things. Were you on Hot Dog, the movie? That was Hot a ski Dog. Film. Holy mackerel! I or remember that. Say, hey, how about that Midnight Madness, which um, was a film with Michael J. Fox's first uh, film, as a matter of fact. I think I remember that. A Disney film. It was like an all-night treasure hunt. All night. So all night. And Did you ever find any treasure? Uh, yeah, we we kind of you know it's a it is an all night treasure hunt. It takes place all in supposedly in one night, running around looking for uh, clues in Los Angeles, and yeah, we there was a little treasure at the end of that rainbow. Anyway, of course, we're talking with David Naughton, who obviously we all remember from uh, from any of our particularly favorites in the past. Uh, now, you know, obviously, I, when I was a kid, and I really hate to great to hate to do this because I because I, I know because I know. Hey, I just turned forty, so I'm I, you know I'm I'm starting to get to that point where you know I'm you know I'm, I'm getting where to what? like gee, I remember, you know, kids are saying and eh, when I when I was a kid. But of course, I mean, the Dr Pepper commercials were 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 what really launched your career. I think is that not correct? Uh, insofar as, uh, as I mean, having the exposure was just national tremendous. attention. Yeah, I did have a lot of national attention from that. Um, these were national commercials, so yeah. But I, you know, I was an actor who trained um, in London before I went and returned to New York, where I had auditioned for those commercials and um, was picked. Classical training. Yeah, I did. I, I little did I know I was training to be a pepper. <laughs> but in actual fact, that's that's uh, that's what happened. Yeah. So you never know how a career is going to take you, and. Um, you just try to be a little bit, uh, you know, ready for anything. Now, when I saw that you were going to be here personally, I was just absolutely thrilled because I, I, one of my all-time favorite movies, totally seriously, was American Werewolf in London. I, when that when that came on cable, I would watch it over and over and over again. It was such a good movie. John Landis had such a, a, a had the the whole the whole horror, but yet with the with the with the humor behind it was just it was it was an awesome movie it was an incredible movie and uh i i was i, I really enjoyed it and uh I, I was really sorry when they made when they made when they made american werewolf in paris i was just kind of like heard of that did they do that it, it was i, I, I didn't was, know yeah, it, it wasn't a bad movie but it it, it just it was not it was not anywhere near i i just didn't think they should have even made it okay I, I just you 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 ruined. I mean, I you 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 ruined it. Out of it. What? Talk about him. Leave everything else out of it. I was just making a comment. I was I was, I was I was I was I was saying how I was trying to compare it how much better his movie was. How's it going for all you folks? It's going fine for me. Would you? Here you go. Would you like to take that? Anyway, my next guest is a fellow from. Well, please welcome our host. Here he is now. Hi, how's it going? Hey, Dave. I'm, I'm fine, good, how are you? Um, I really wasn't prepared for this, but... Now, no, so tell us what's, what's, uh, what's, going on, what's, what's going on lately. I see we've got, uh, we've, well, this we're, we've a, got some updated things here. Being a horror, uh, you know, sort of horror-themed convention, I brought primarily stuff from American Werewolf, um, as you, which you can probably see, yeah. That kind of... You know, <laughs> That, that's kind of like Mike here without, uh, without enough rest or food. Yeah, so, yeah, there's um, primarily, as I said, mostly uh, pictures here from Werewolf. Although, you know, I do have on the end here, there is the occasional oh pepper. Oh, my God, look at that. There is the occasional pepper that comes by, and that I have to amazing. just let them know that, yes, they too can be a pepper. Do, do, do you ever get anybody who come up with you, uh, come up to you with a, with a can of Dr. Pepper and ask you to autograph that? I have, uh, yes. And also, you know, I had a, a record that, that was back in the disco days called Making It, which was a number five record in the top 40. And um, people say, wait a second, are you the same David Naughton that was in American Werewolf in London? I go, yes. <laughs> As opposed to... I know. Yeah. Okay. You, you just don't know. I mean, I would like to have how a many little da list of... How many David Naughtons are there? Yeah, well, and, you know, they find out that there's one and... And, you know, I would like to say ten, the ten funniest questions you're asked, you know, when you get back here. Um, probably, as I was saying to you before, the first one is, 
where did you shoot an American Werewolf in London? I go, I'm just, there's a clue there. I, it's uh, somewhere on the other side of the water. I can't remember. Yeah. Somewhere in Europe, I think it was, yeah. if I remember correctly. Well, I was to say, like, like we, we get all the time, we get people saying, hey, oh, the midnight movie. So, so when's that on? Yeah. Well, anyway. actually, actually, it's on at 8.30 on Monday, so, because we show three times a week. Well, then, there you go. So, so it's not such so a crazy not really, question. Not huh? always, no, no. But, uh, so what, I, what, uh, what have you, do you have anything uh, uh, going Seriously? right now that we should be looking for? You know, there's a new commercial on right now that's, well, you're, you know, a, a cable show, so maybe, maybe you do have commercials. We on have it. commercials. Oh, do you? Oh, yeah. Um, I don't know that I can mention necessarily the product, but it's a pizza, and there's four, there are men, there are four men the former presidents at Mount Rushmore arguing over what kind of pizza to order, and I'm Abraham Lincoln. Okay, I just let you in on a little secret. <laughs> Super. So who gets to choose? Or is, um, that, or is they giving we it away? You know, no, we're all just kind of arguing with each other. Things like, don't make me come over there. You know, some funny lines. Um, Listen, monument head, I want pepperoni. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you guys are actually the, 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 the stone faces. Yes, oh, are. I we get are. you. We are. Boy, that could, that, could get, that could get a little dangerous. It could, and we're hoping it could just run forever. You have Cary Grant running around on your heads up that there? That would be good. We have Granite Head, uh, Cary Granite, actually. Or, no, we don't. We've got, you know, if, for people that don't remember who those four are present, George Washington, Thomas Jefferson, Teddy Roosevelt, and Abraham and Lincoln. Lincoln. And, well, that's uh, so. There you go. Well, that's great. So you were. It's all, that I, I'm looking. Stuff. Is it out? Is it is it out? It's showing supposed it? to start uh, September 17th, which was last night. And did I sit at home and watch TV? No, I'm in Middlesburg Heights. You got to go out. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. I'm okay. looking. I can't wait to see that. Look for it. All right. Well, hey, thanks very much My for taking pleasure. the time out to thanks, talk Dave. to us. It's great meeting you. Good luck with your show. Thanks. Yeah, we need it. Trust me. Yeah. Well, hey, why don't you go back to uh, the movie and uh, what are we showing? Did you did you say what we were showing? Night of the Blood Beast. How do you like that? You're on Night of the Blood Beast. Isn't Excellent. that exciting? I'm all for it. I <laughs> Maybe we're related. Hey, I, well, it could be. I don't know. I haven't seen the Blood Beast, but uh, go back and then we'll see who else we can. Uh,